my name is Joy of Joy's Brews. Anytime you see me, ask me what brew I have on hand and feel free to come by and have a taste. I have a very active social life and I always work with my travel cup. And people would ask me what brew you have in your cup. So that's why I came up with the name Joy's Brews. So Joy's Brews comprise of cocktails that are traditional favorites and then you have my signature cocktails meaning my versions of brews it's friday evening ready for your first cocktail so what would you like to try Consultant of the Fashion Arts, we're here at the Carnival Pop-Up Night Market Edition. Welcome. So this, the Carnival Pop-Up is actually, I think it's in its fourth or fifth year. I've actually been doing pop-ups since 2017. Um, it's something where I understand the importance of local and I want others to also know about local and support local. Uh, my pop-ups are actually themed. So I do for Carnival, Easter, Mother's Day, and I spot for Christmas. So we have actually try to have products that are for that theme. So I am quite familiar with the fashion art for a few years um, and it has been really an experience to me where it, it gives me the ability to, you know, meet a lot of my customers that I would not normally meet on a regular basis. Um, Carnival has changed significantly, so for Monday wear is definitely a thing. Persons don't want to look basic on the road anymore. They want to make sure that they look the best, so they go all out. So my name is Adiola Montague, and I am the designer and owner of Genesis Swimwear. Supporting local, of course, to me is very important. The local entrepreneur, especially the creative entrepreneur, they are most in this space right now. They are more important, I believe. Yes, agriculture, we need that as well. But because of the pandemic, especially, there was a, a low down, so in a long, a down time for them when nothing was happening. So actually, now as we have a space that we can actually offer them the opportunity to show what they're producing and show and for them to express their creativity, I think it's very important. At Keisha's Creations, I do handmade products. I do all of my packaging myself. Some of my products include crystals, handmade rings. I also do handmade stationery as well, journals and notebooks. I have other themed items. I do charm bracelets, um, leather bands and bracelets as well. Carnival is something that is really special to the Caribbean, so today I was really curious to see all the other local artisans present today and also to see the other products that are being showcased here today. Just being able to have a conversation about something that I've made and hearing someone else appreciate that and like what I do makes it worthwhile. I am Keisha from Keisha's Creations. I am an online based store. You can find me on WhatsApp, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Enjoy Carnival 2023. We are located in Tobago. We manufacture products at the Adventure Micro Enterprise Centers to Plymouth, Tobago. Okay, well, first of all, if you want to be an entrepreneur, you must be able to take risk. Risk must have a, be a risk taker. There are the ups and there are the downs. At times, sometimes you come to these events and sometimes you sit here and you have a good product and sometimes you don't make any sales. And then another time, it is very, very good.
name is Sheldon Martin Warner and the brand is called SM Warner Art with Attitude. The brand we offer hand painted everything. Everything is a canvas, right? So for men we have hand painted ties, t-shirts, shirts, um, caps. For ladies we have the dresses, skirts, things like that. Everything is one of a kind, right? So it all depends on what the client wants. We could actually do custom work, so I will actually meet with the clients and we will decide what is we want based on what I offer, my kind of work, and then we go from there. So if you see something, that means you could get the same vibe, but you wouldn't get the same thing. The concept is that we're one of a kind, the only one in the world. The whole vibe of meeting other creatives like that is nothing you can actually experience by doing something virtual, right? Because the the conversation that you'll get from your other creative and so on like that is so it's close, you understand what I mean? It's it's inspiring. You can inspire somebody, you could they inspire you.